Hi, my name's Jill Galloway. I'm an artist educator at the National Portrait Gallery and a full-time artist with JJ Galloway Studio. In today's open studio lesson, we're talking about quilling. It's an art form that uses the rolling or bending or folding of paper to make your designs. Quilling is absolutely one of my favorite art lessons to teach because it's so relaxing. You don't need to have any skills to do this lesson and any age group can try it out. You can keep your project very simple or you can make it very complex. It's really up to you. Okay, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need is strips of construction paper, any color and as many colors as you can get your hands on would be great. And I've cut these into about one inch strips. You'll also need some glue and some cardboard and some scissors. To keep things simple for today, let's just trace the outline of our hand for our design. Now you'll need to get some glue out. I like to put some glue in a tray or some kind of lid or something so that you can easily get to it. There's really as many ways as you can think of to make these quill spirals. You can just start with a simple circle, or you can take a circle and pinch the sides to make a diamond, or a square, or a heart. Once you have your shape, you just dip it in the glue and then add it down to the inside of your design. You'll fill your design with all kinds of shapes. To help get you started, here's some ideas of some of the shapes that you can make. Now you just need to get to work and fill that design with lots of beautiful shapes. Here's an example of a finished hand. Now check out these amazing quilled portraits done by contemporary artist Yulia Brodskaya. Other artists who are trying interesting things with paper are Kumi Yamashita. Check out how she's folded this paper to make the shadow a portrait. Also check out this silhouette done by Christy Malakoff. This piece is titled Maypole and there's 20 children cut out from paper dancing around the pole. Thank you so much for joining me for today's open studio lesson. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, please post your results on your social media accounts with the hashtag MyNPG so we can see what you came up with. Okay, we'll see you next time.